Hi, Wobble Bottom. I have watched both Juggalos are stupid rednecks and Juggalos, I'm sorry I was so mean. <clears throat> and the only reason I'm here is because of the latter, which is Juggalos, I'm sorry I was so mean. Um, my question is, why would you start off saying that uh, you're apologizing and then completely and totally change what you were saying and start bashing again? I mean, it's kind of contradictory, you know, contradict yourself, saying, hey, I'm sorry, I was such a dick, and I really want to apologize, and then going and completely and totally contradicting yourself and turning everything around. I mean, that's a real dick move that really makes you seem like a troll. I mean... I have to say, though, you have a nice beard. wish I had a beard like that. Because beards are the shit. But I like my beard. Anyway, that's neither here nor there. As you said in your video about Batman. But, uh, let me see. I'm going to continue from where I was. Oh, side note. Uh there is a point to where your First Amendment right does end. I mean, yes, you have freedom of speech, but you were not free to slander anybody. I mean, everything you said slandered juggalos, and that is not protected by the First Amendment rights. Albeit, Yes, you do have your right to an opinion, and you are allowed to have one, but slander, slandering someone is not a part of free speech. You know what you just said there? You, if you don't have anything nice to say, don't say anything at all. I just recently said that in another video to someone else. The internet is a place where you can grandstand and stand on your fucking e soapbox and you can shout to the world that you have all these stupid opinions and you want everybody to know. And That's slightly true. You are allowed to stand on your e soapbox and, you know, shout to the world about what you want to say. But, again,. First Amendment rights don't do not protect you from, you know, slander. You are not allowed to slander when it comes down to the First Amendment rights. By golly. Sort of. I mean, there's. I don't really remember all the amendments. I don't remember exactly what they say, and I don't quite feel like looking them up. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. And frankly, I think you juggalos are a big waste of time. You look Again, contradictory. Your description says, I make a heartfelt apology to the most insane of clowns, the Juggalos. And yet, let's back up a little bit. And frankly, I think you Juggalos are a big waste of time. That is completely contradictory. Yes, albeit our music may be funny to you, but to most juggalos, there's meaning behind the music. I mean, for some of us, it's what saved us from, you know, going down a bad path. Yes, there are many juggalos that got into the family and then went down the wrong path anyway, but that was them, not everybody else. Oh, and I'm going to back myself up a little bit, because you said earlier, you were talking earlier in your video about the face paint. The original meaning behind the face paint was to hide 
you know, you see this? See the color of my skin? It was to hide that. And the face paint is... Let me see if I can word this correctly. The face paint brings out what's inside of you. And you keep... It was originally meant to keep others from judging what's inside. Or to keep others from judging what's on the outside, you know. Keep you from being judged for the color of your skin. But to be judged by your words. Let's continue. Now we're getting into dare. Why? Now that is kind of funny. His teeth look like stalactites filled with fucking fudge. I wonder what he does on his free time. Aside from smoking meth and crack and shooting heroin and snorting coke. Um, we don't call ICP our juggalo Jesus. We just call them ICP because that's who they are. Albeit, yes, they are the quote unquote. Oh, actually, let me phrase this the way most people would like me to phrase it. They are the quote leaders of the Juggalo family, unquote. But they're also just Juggalos. They are just, you know, part of the family. They don't force feed us Fago. They. The reason that the whole Fago thing was started. I'm checking my time real quick because I've only got two minutes and thirty seconds left. Wait, wait, wait. Two minutes and twenty minutes left. You're twenty seconds left. The Fago was the whole reason behind the Fago was because that was all the soda that ICP had when they were kids and they just grew up with it. A lot of jugglers grew up with Fago. Fago was the cheapest soda. I mean, shit. A dollar for a three liter of fucking soda? Come on. Who's not going to take that up? Again, 99 cents for a three liter. Not all of us. I mean... Yes, at this very point in time, I'm on food stamps, but that's only because, you know, I don't have a job. But, then again, I'm also still going through school, so I don't quite have time for a job. And yet you still said it. Backtracking much? And then you bring up Isham. I laugh out loud at you. Not really. Anyway, I guess I got I got as much of my point as I can, and I've only got 20 seconds left. So, guess all I have to say now in my 12 seconds is, why do you hate Juggalos? What is your problem with Juggalos? Anyway, I'm out of time. So, have fun.